वेलकम गाइस तेजस हियर विथ फ्यूचर एडोमेशन सो हियर आई हैव बॉट अ न्यू सीरीज दैट इज पीसी और ओएस ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम्स एटोमेशन यूजिंग पाइथन सो कंट्रोलिंग योर डे टू डे सब रूटीन ऑफ योर पीसी इज काइंड ऑफ हेक्टिक वर्क लाइक सॉर्टिंग योर फाइल्स मैनेजिंग योर इंफॉर्मेशन इन द फाइल्स रीनेमिंग योर हेवी बंच ऑफ फाइल्स सो दीस हार्ड वर्क्स कैन बी डन बाय अ सिंगल क्लिक यूजिंग पाइथन and uh, python provides lot of features so you can play with it so today is just a demo program and i am going to show you how to control the most simple operations that is shutting down restarting your pc using python so let's go for it now this video will step by step show you how to <coughs> control the shutdown restart processes in the python using a predefined time which you can further use for scheduling your day to day sub routines now let's go for it first there are two important libraries which you will be importing and they are already pre installed in your python when you install it in your pc so first one is the time the time library consists of methods which you can use for catching the system time and using it for your scheduling the next import library is a sub process the sub process is one of the most important libraries which you will be using for sending the commands to the operating system through the cmd now the process is behind the scenes so we can't see it but the thing that it will work now i have used the loop so that the program will ch check the time for each and every second so that you can get the exact time which you have predefined here the next is uh, the time dot local time method now this method will catch the <coughs> system time but unfortunately the format of this method is structure so we cannot use the structure format for validating our conditions so the thing we do we can do is that convert the given time into a string now this method that is asc time will convert the structure met format into the string format and give us now the next process which we have to do is that we have to convert the string into a list separated each <coughs> separated each element by a space now here we are going to use the split method which comes with the string so that we can split each and every element where it encounters the space now this thing will help us to <coughs> validate each and every element of the list and use it for scheduling let's let's go for it so the most important and final method which we are going to call is sub process dot call now this method is the one which will control the operation or the shutdown restart process of your pc so here i will explain each and every parameter one by one shutdown sends the command shutdown to the pc which will further be validated by slash yes now you can change the slash yes to r for restart a for about l for log off now yes we are using here so that we can shut down the pc next let's go for the slash t which will obviously everyone knows give the tap space between commands and the 7 is be is going to be the time timer which will count the time for sending this command to the system and take the delay so that you can get a warning message that your pc is going to be shut down now here i am going to record the further video through my phone so that you can get the each and every scene of the windows getting shut down so let's go for it so it is just oh my bad just a second just a second i have not specified the time so here now it's 1236 so we have to go for 1237 38 sorry now it it has gone to 1237 so <clears throat> now i have specified the time to 1238 with 00 second now you, here you can see that the time is 1237 at 20 seconds am so it will check for each and every second that whether the time is 1238 or not and if it encounters the time to 1238 then it will shut down the pc so let's go for it 
yes it will be saved and the time is on now here it is waiting for the exact time which we have specified and as it get that time it will shut down the PC yeah on in seven seconds so I'm going to yeah now the PC is uh, getting shut down as you can see it um, so we cannot record it through the screen so I am recording it from my phone and yeah it is shut down so here guys my PC is started again and as you can see that sorry it is getting at all yeah so uh, my PC started again now I will come back on my screen record welcome back guys so as you saw that uh, my PC is started now and this was kind of fun you know so uh, this was just a demo program to show you that how powerful Python is for controlling many more things so do hit the like button and subscribe my channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you can get notified for new few more tricks and tips of using python and controlling your day-to-day -day subroutines so see you soon